welcome to digital mantra in this video we will be going to be learning about how to make a ship in tinkercad so first of all click on create new design then we have the interface so first of all we will pick up a cone and a roof to make the base of our shape so make the height of this roof as 20 and the length should be 40 and make the height as 20 and take this length as 40 now what we are going to do next is we will align them in the same line and make sure that both of this top tips should be in touch with each other so what we are going to do is that we will make sure that both are touching itself and if we are encountering an error please reduce the snap grid so it will get easy to align them we are creating all L in center and then with the help of shift we will be aligning them in a proper manner so here we can see there is still something is left and now this is complete so now what we are going, going to do we will pick up a box which is a hole and make make its height as equal to 10 and spread it in a large area so that it can cover it can cover the ship base and then we will lift it up by 10 by value of 10 and then select all and group them all so here we have a ship and then we will mirror this on the top of side so here we got the ship what we are so this is the first step in this process then to make a dock type of structure in the front we will be using one cylinder make it width as 40 its height as 3 or make it 3 3 is good to see then we will first of all we will create an internal part so control D then by pressing alt we will click this thing in the inside so that we can remove the internal part so click on the inside click hole and then group it control g so we have this type of structure then we will select a box so we have a box it doesn't matter which side you are how how much of size you are taking because we just need it to cover the half of the portion of this and we are not going to be using any scale at this moment because we are ma making this on a random scale we have to select this and then take a roof and convert it to hole then rotate it by 45 degree reduce the size increase it by this and decrease the value to 3 then rotate it in horizontal direction by 90 degree and pick it up and then place it at this position place it at this position and drag it so that if it will cover the entire area what we are seeing here so that we will get a perfect design of a dog here now control G so we have a sorry 
like we make it much so now we have this as place control g we have this type of structure now we will take it take it to the top area of the dock and then lift it up from the plane then you will find a structure something like this so we have a top structure which you can see like this first of all to make it a good structure we will click it as 18 value and then we will drag it from the side that it will remain and we can also align it with the base so it is at the center now we will make the top portion of this base shape and once again we are going to take a cone and then a roof make the height as 12 and the length as of 20 here we are taking it as a okay let's take it as 40 so we have the second part take it the height as 12 and then take it as 20 and we will attach the both of the both of the figure make the width as 60 sorry 18 here and then align both of them in center so we have this type of figure here 20 okay we need to first of all so we need to make this also of 18 size and then once again align them the center and we have this type of figure make it perfect so that it can create a perfect structure here and check the pin point if there is any gap between them so here we can see there are some gaps here so what you have to do you will lift it <coughs> some more amount so yes now we are good with this now once again i will select the box make the height make the height as value of 6 drag it to cover the whole of the area then lift it lift it up by value 6 and then control g group it together and change the color so that it will look like awesome let's make it orange so here we will drag this figure in this place and then we can lift it up you can also use a shortcut key of control and up arrow to lift it from the plane so we will check that it is slightly submerged here okay so it is okay now click on this and align them so that they will be in the straight value here okay so now our next step is to make a slightly same type of structure here control d now here we will be editing this size make the height as 10 size as 16 change the color to what is the bottom color so we have this okay we have this color we got this now
making the height 10 okay we will make at this position so reduce slightly by clicking alt on the inner side we can re reduce the size so we have this type of structure which is slightly outside from here now by moving it we will get a good idea about what type of structures we need to cross lift it on the back side and we will now we will reduce this to the inside okay and now this is the top of our boat now it is looking perfect now to give it a dynamic look we will be using roof type of structure by making it a thickness of 1 make the size 4 here we are, we are going to turn for like 90 degree we will be reducing the size to 4 in the same plane I will control D and then I will make the same figure again and we, will, we will try to make it a same figure again so we have this thing both of them together so we will try to align them wait let's just try to move it so that it will okay so we have a perfect figure here now save them and control G so we have we can give it a color of orange now drag it up drag it up and take them in that size now we will be watching from the top that we will place it at the right position here So select, try to make it the center, ok. To get a perfect here, we will be using select both of them and then align the center. now we will we will combine all of them and then control g click on click here and click on multi color so now to give it a little bit of dynamic look what we what we are going to do is we will lift it from the top by very small amount like this and then we will turn it on the sideways so that it will look like we are watching a real real boat so now it's like this and when we see from the side it looks perfect like a ship we are watching from the top we can see this so here this was the end of today's video so if you want any other 3d modeling of any other physical objects then you can type in the comments if you have any queries please tell me in the comments if you like this video please like share and subscribe and learn keep learning 3d modeling is not easy in the frequent lectures you will also get tutorials about autocad and solidworks so be prepared with this this software is very easy so give it a try do what best you can do about this 
बेस्ट ऑफ लक बी हेल्दी